Good morning, it's Francis. It's 7.49 a.m. on Friday, October 7th. This video is my newest images of the space where Comet Elenin is. I have not looked at these images yet. I took them about an hour ago from New Mexico. And um, I've always said if I wanted to do anything, I wanted to share these images with you as I see them. And this is my way. So this is the first time I've seen the videos. I have my uh, Subaru image processor, a Mac Eli, I up. And we're going to go uh, open some uh, new images that I took this morning. I've taken an uh, HA filter, hydrogen alpha, and an I filter, near infrared. And I have to find out where they are. And um, this is 2011.10. This is the HA filter. And now we're going to, I'm going to zoom in, I know. We're gonna be doing a lot of stuff because see I, I I at this moment I'm not I'm gonna open up my other picture too. Open this is the HA. We're gonna open the I filter too, the near infrared. And here's the near infrared image. Let's zoom out a little bit. Okay, the first thing that I'm noticing is that not noticing anything right away. I'm going to zoom in here. I'm going to get you in close as we can. I'm going to add a little. This is the near infrared image. So let me go see if we can look at this in a different color mode. Let's look at it in um, blue. I want to lighten it up a little bit. Actually, for our needs, we need to darken it up a little bit. We need to zoom in because right off the bat, now the, the stars are elongated because I tracked for 300 seconds, that's five minutes, and our objects should be round, common elements should be round because it's been tracking on the comet, but these are the first time we're looking at these. You're seeing these as I see them. And um, the first obvious thing is, is that I don't see anything obvious. I don't see anything obvious in it. Let me go back to the other one. Let's make this one bigger. See what we're gonna. What I'm gonna start doing is compare, having to compare the two, and finding out what we're looking at. Because see, we'll have we have some matching stars. So I can look at these three stars right here. One, two, three. Those are, and see, there's actually a different focus involved. This is a, a pull, a zoomed in. See, this one's kind of farther out. Let's look at these three stars right here. One, two, three. And now I'll pull out also a little bit. See, that is pulled out a little bit. We have one, two, three. Then I'm going to go to this one, open it up, pull out a little bit. Well, I guess not. It's just a different image. So the first thing I say is, wow. I don't know. Um, now there's this item over here. Let me blow this one up. This item right here, which is black here. See, I think this this is an image perfection, I believe. Zoom in on this black item here. 
because on the other picture I have this item here You know, I hate. Uh, I'm not even. Gonna, I'm gonna keep looking at the images. See, because I can zoom in close. And I have to. What I have to do is I have to get in here. See, and there's two stars, and I need to look at the other image here. And find out how close I can get in. So we can get in real close and we can lighten and darken this and we should be able to find pieces because I, it was a clear night common elements in this picture we should be able to find something of her in here I believe these are hot pixels we see all these elongated stars they're all there because of the exposure time so that the, the lens was open for five minutes. These pictures are going to be looked at now. I'm going to be looking at the images for a while today, this morning. I have to, it's been a month now since I've been dealing with images, so I have to. What I have to do is I have to have this matching. I'm going to get these matched up. And I'm going to say I'm going to have a hard time today getting my stuff together. Okay, there. There. Let me zoom in soon so you can see. I'm, I'm trying to line up these images so that I can look for what object. See what I'm seeing. What am I seeing? That's the HA. There's the I. See, now I can open this. I need to just get these open a little bit more. Brighten this up. Basically what I'm looking at is the center of the image. Somewhere in here, this is where the common element should be located. I've used filters, an HA and a near-infrared. And, and the last time I took HA filter and near-infrared images of common element, she showed up. So, uh, at this moment, I don't have a common element. What I'm going to do is look through them. I'm looking for something definitely round. It should be in the center of the image. What is that? This is the eye filter. And I remember the last time I took an eye filter, what did I see? I saw an ice cream cone. So maybe I'm looking for an ice cream cone here too. Here's the HA. The HA was round when I took it. Now yesterday Leonid Alenin spoke, took some pictures of his comet, Comet Alenin, and he showed a very dim spot, 18th magnitude. I have to look at these images in different colors and really go over them and, and to give you a really good report. Let's go 
because I don't think I, I'm going to find it right off the bat here. I'm going to have to find. I'm going to have to search and search and search for this here comet. And here is the rainbow reversed. I like the rainbow reversed. But see, you'll see here some colored pixels. These are these are hot pixels. I'm going to open this up. See what we can get out of them. I'm just I'm I'm looking for pieces. I'm looking for what we're looking at. You know, at this oh, let's get to the center of the picture. This is me seeing the picture with you at the same time. It's the first time I've looked at the images. See, I don't know what this is. Let's see. I don't know. That looks like. So these are all stars. All the white objects are stars. What's this one down here? This is interesting. And that's kind of right near the center. Okay, let me go back. Color mode. See, this is showing us all the objects that would appear. I'll, I'll zoom in there. These are all the objects in the space where Ellen should be. I have to check out all these little spots and see what they are. This is with the HA filter. Now, when I took an HA filter on September 2nd, comment was round. I need to go through all of this and see because the comet is not plainly visible in my image. I don't know what that is. I don't know if that's an image perfection or not. That is the only round thing I see in my images. And I'm going to have to but see that's that's got a that's got a big circle around it too. This is going to be an image perfection. Or I'm going to have to check again. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool visual. So I, I've enhanced the image and draw out. And you can see that. I've enhanced this spot down here. Now I'll enhance the whole thing. But I have to check that. Then I have to go check what's that up there. What's this up here? Let's see, I, I, I just see that's this. I believe is an image perfection here. All the stars should be. I suppose that the star is closer though. And I have this item down here. I don't really have to uh, see, but I think these are imperfections again. Also, that's probably an imperfection. This is probably an imperfection. But you and I are seeing, looking at the images for the first time together. I'm gonna have to do more. See, this has got. This is a dust particle. I don't know what that very, very center. See, there's a center. There's a little circle. I think I have to go back and do a dark frame and see where the imperfections may be. But see, mostly all this other stuff I'm just seeing as, as the stars, because of their elongation, they sh the comet will not be elongated. See, I see it. I think I see a dust over here, and I see a dust over here. That's what's making these little circles. And it's not the comet. I don't know if this is the comet up here. I'm going to run out of time on, the, on this video, so this is the search. The search has begun. 
Find Comet Elenin again. Find what Comet Elenin. Elenin. Find Comet Elenin in your images. And I used filters. I didn't use just a regular uh, camera lens. So I have to go through and look. I will tell you, my report this morning is I could not immediately find the comet. I have to continue looking at the pictures. But we.